Golo Go Digest is another supplement from the Golo company. In this quick video, we're going to talk about the research and the ingredients on Golo Digest and how to get your money back if you think it's not working for you. Let's go. As the name suggests, Golo Go Digest is primarily a digestion supplement. And so, as you can see here, there is a lot of short-term and long-term benefits that the company lists for Golo Digest, ranging from improved digestion to even lower cholesterol levels. And while that is nice, no clinical research on Golo Go Digest could be located. That doesn't necessarily mean it doesn't exist. It just means that I could not locate any of that research on the Golo website. So having said that, what can we learn from the ingredients in Golo Go Digest? So here is the Golo Digest supplement facts label. And as you can see, each capsule contains a proprietary blend containing 400 milligrams of each of these ingredients, which are for the most part, a combination of enzymes that digest proteins, carbohydrates, and fats. While companies don't have to tell us the actual amounts of each ingredient in proprietary blends, what we can say is that ingredients at the top of the list make up most of the proprietary blend, while ingredients at the bottom make up the least. So the protease blend makes up most of the Golo Go Digest blend, while the hemicellulase enzyme makes up the least. I also want to call your attention to this ingredient, Bacillus subtilis DE111. DE111 is a specific strain of the bacteria Bacillus subtilis. Each capsule of Golo Go Digest provides 1 billion colony forming units of this bacterial strain. Keep that in mind. The company also calls attention to ginger and cinnamon as providing antioxidant support for the body. And there again is this specific strain of bacteria Bacillus subtilis DE111. The fact that they are calling this bacterial strain out tells us that Golo thinks that this is really important. So what is the evidence for Bacillus subtilis DE111? So there is some research suggesting that Bacillus subtilis DE111 might lower cholesterol levels and even improve the health of the blood vessel lining, the endothelium. Other research suggests that the microbiome of small children is favorably improved and Bacillus subtilis DE111 might even improve the immune systems of athletes by reducing a substance called TNF-alpha, tissue necrosis factor alpha. The good news here is that Golo Go Digest also contains the same dosage of the Bacillus subtilis DE111 probiotic bacteria as is used in many clinical trials, 1 billion colony forming units. And while that is good, I'm not yet convinced that the research on Bacillus subtilis DE111 is so cut and dry, so I'm going to link to the review on Bacillus subtilis DE111 that I did below this video so you can see the research for yourself and draw your own conclusions. Turning our attention to the Better Business Bureau, we see that they give Golo an A plus rating when I check their website. Like all popular businesses, Golo is not immune from customer complaints. However, the good news here is that the company does indeed respond to customer complaints that are lodged with the Better Business Bureau. I did not see any Golo Go Digest customer complaints listed with the Better Business Bureau, so leave a comment below and let me know what you think of this supplement so I can learn from you. As for the Golo return policy, I think the refund policy can be better. While I do like that Golo supplements come with a 60 day refund policy and that the 60 days begins when you receive your supplements, not when you order them. I don't like that refunds are only good for first time orders only. So if you had tried Golo Digest, returned it and got a refund, but then a few months later decided to give it a try again, you would not be able to get a refund on that second order. Now to get a refund on Golo supplements, you have to first call or email Golo customer support and obtain what's called a return authorization number, RMA number. That's really important. And when you do that, the Golo customer support personnel will give you the address on where to send the supplements back. And I would say return everything, any pamphlets you received, etc. send everything back to the company to get your refund. 
As for how much does Golo Digest cost? So here are the prices that are listed on the Golo website when I checked it. Keep in mind that the prices may change when you see this video and look on their website for yourself. I did a little math and basically Golo Go Digest comes to about 30 cents per capsule, whether you purchase one bottle, two bottles, or three bottles at a time. Also, there's no auto shipments here. When you run out of Golo Digest supplements, you've got to contact a company to get more. That's also good. It means you're not going to get hit with any unwanted, unexpected credit card charges. Golo supplements come with free shipping in the United States. However, if you are in Canada, expect to pay an additional $25 surcharge. So what do I think of Golo Go Digest? So I didn't try the supplement, so I have no direct knowledge of it. I can see how some people who may have digestive problems may benefit from the digestive enzymes. However, if you don't have any digestive problems, I don't think you'll see many results from that. That said, I do think a lot of the benefits that people may receive from this may be due to the Bacillus subtilis DE111 probiotic bacteria. And I'll link to my review of the DE111 probiotic below so you can check it out and see the research for yourself. Now, if you're on the fence and you think that Golo Digest is a little pricey, but you're still intrigued by Bacillus subtilis DE111 research, I will say that you can probably find this probiotic supplement either by itself or alongside other probiotics. I would say shop around either online or even at local health food stores. I have seen this probiotic bacteria online, so definitely shop around if this is something you're interested in. So what are your thoughts on Golo Go Digest? Leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about all this. And until next time, take care out there.